Uh, hello everyone and welcome to our YouTube page. So today we are going to start off by talking about how you can do time-based option backtesting on the Kiev platform. So once you log in, you will come towards the option, option part where you can click on create. And there you can click on advanced option or strategy builder. The bank the strike price would already be there. It would be the ATM strike price of zero. The quantity would be the lot size that you can change according to your preference. So for the purposes of this example, where we'll be backtesting a time-based option strategy, I'll be adding let's say one more leg and we'll uh, let's say we'll backtest a short strangle or a short straddle. So for for a short uh, straddle, the strike price should be the same. So here we are taking ATM strike price only, and we'll be selling the call and the put uh, options. So here we'll be naming the strategy, let's say uh, BNF straddle backtest. So then uh, my entry time and exit time would be important because I'm, I'll be backtesting a time-based strategy only. So let's say I want to enter into the trade at let's say 9.30. I want to give the first 30 minutes to the market to settle down. And because I'm selling a straddle, I want, uh, after, I want a period of low volatility so that I can gain from the expiry day or whatever the day movements are there. So I'd be uh, entering into that position, let's say at uh, 9.30. And because it's a uh, premium kind of a strategy, a seller strategy, I don't want to wait till the last minute to exit and exit my position. I want to, I want to wait, let's say, uh, 2 o'clock or 2.30, after which I don't want to enter into the day and volatility as well. So I want to exit my position at uh, 2.30. So here I'll be adding my stop loss based on the absolute value of my PNL. So it will be 300 or 700 or you can change it to let's say uh, 500 and 2000. So accordingly your uh, risk reward ratio would also be calculated for your trade. So here I'm not going to select moving stop loss to cost because I don't want to do it as of now and the system generated 15 rupees brokerage will be added to your PNL port order and the slippage would be 0.5%. So here, once you click on run and backtest, it will be backtesting this uh, short strangle strategy. On the intraday basis, my ATM would be based on the futures and the expiry that would be taking the option on would be uh, this weekly. And the date range that will be selected for this backtest would be let's say three months only. So here we are seeing that in the last three months, my PNL for the for this strategy if I'm entering into a 9.30 to 2.30 kind of a short strangle position daily, then it is this. But when you click on, let's say, view backtest, so here you will get a more clear understanding of on which days or where is your maximum loss is happening or where your maximum profit is happening. So here we can see our maximum loss is happening on the expiry day or on the previous expiry day, that was on Tuesday. And in the last three months only, this, this moment has come. So here uh, we'll also be looking at uh, our earlier this PNL. So as we saw earlier, our stop loss would be nearer to 500, nearer to 600 based on some slippage, and our take profit would be around 1500, around 1400, as uh, as we put it on the system earlier. And here you will be uh, checking different different orders because because the position was entered, you would also get a reason about why there was an exit on this position. For example, the exit was due to EOD or due to strategy stop loss or so on and so forth. So this is how you can use, you can backtest your own time-based option strategy on Keeve and you can uh, find uh, which strategy would work better in which market and so on and so forth. Uh, hopefully this video was educational for you. Look forward to you in the coming videos. Thank you.